Young and the Restless fan fiction, rivals that never end but only gets more manipulative. Young and the Restless fans all know there are numbers of rivals and rivalries in the soap, and the new Young and the Restless fan fiction story definitely attracts far more soap fans who are missing the daily dose of soapy and manipulative scenarios in the form of rivalry. So let's talk about the fan fiction, shall we? The Blonde vs. the Red. Did you realize whom the story is going to be based on? Well, it is Abby Newman the Blonde and Phyllis Summers the Redhead. The story goes on with Abby glancing across the street at the Grand Phoenix Hotel. That was a good practice run for the real thing. With a smirk on her face and a glim in her eyes, she prepared for the evening's festivities. Family, her hotel, the Lee Locks, which is French word for luxury, envious, was ready for its grand opening. Abby had decided to add envious in her description as a dick to her competitor, Phyllis. She was looking around and was pleased with the finishing results, so exquisite and breathtaking, thinking how it made Grand Phoenix as a dollar night motel. While well, Abby knows that her rival Redhead is planning to sabotage her opening night, not knowing that she knows already, has a little surprise waiting for her. On the other hand, Phyllis is getting ready for her uninvited entrance at the event with a perfect dress and even planned a spa day to indulge herself. Giggling away for her housewarming gift for Abby, she was pleased with herself. But Abby is after all her mother's daughter and inherited a knack for chemistry, concocted the most irresistible fragrances. She knew that the redhead was going to come to the Grand Phoenix Saloon to pamper herself created a surprise rinse for Phyllis. Playing with her ego, Abby added a note saying shine and be noticed by everyone. Time was running and Phyllis told Nick Newman that they were invited, well, he was and she was just entering. Feeling very confident, Phyllis took Nick's arms and looked Abby right in her eyes who smiled politely and greeted them as they entered the hotel lobby. While Nick was off to get drinks, she felt a tingling sensation only to find everyone laughing at her. While she caught a glimpse of herself, for her horror, her beautiful red hair was gone and her bald head was beaming like a spotlight attracting everyone's attention. Looking at Abby, she thought what did she do? and wait till she opens my gift. So what do you think Phyllis's gift is?